Hello everybody, welcome back. I'm going to go over finding new referral partners, places to go to find them. Okay, so first place, Realtor.com, Homes.com, OnlineNewspapers.com. I'm going to go over each one of these individually, so hang with me. Local Newspapers, Craigslist, Backpage, and Facebook. Unbelievable place to find agents that are actually getting it, that understand the value of social media, under, understand the value of the internet. So let's go to Realtor.com really quick. I'm going to share with you where to go on that. So you go to Realtor.com. They added a new tab actually for us. I think they did it for us loan officers, right? <laughs> okay, I'm just kidding. But you put in your agent only, and then you put in where you're at, and then you click search, and there's 301 agents. And you just scroll down the line, and you, um, you actually it shows their name, who they are. And a lot of times you can click on the actual picture. Let me just show you a picture where you can actually see one. So I click on the Gesner team. And on the Gesner team, it shows average listing price is three hundred thousand seven hundred fifty. Not too bad, actually. That's really good. So I'd probably that'd be a good team to work with. So you can check them out there. There's all their contact info, um, and and then you can of course look them up in your local realtor board or local uh, what is it uh, board of realtors. You can kind of find them there. See if they're on Facebook. Some of the things that I do is I look to see if they're on Facebook. I look to see if they're uh, have a LinkedIn profile. Some of the things that you know we all should be doing to let the world know who we are and what we do for a living okay the next one is homes.com that is a great one okay so I'm gonna go to homes.com real quick for you just to kinda of show you how this works so they don't make it real easy on you but here's here's the little secret if you scroll down you click on find an agent right on the bottom right hand corner see it right there click on that and then it's gonna ask you where else you wanna go of course I'm in Kalamazoo Michigan and then find a real estate agent in Kalamazoo Michigan so search and it's going to pull them all up for me in Kalamazoo. So, of course, here's a couple of the agents that work with Dave Ash. And so you can click right on their name and or pr profile, kind of see what they got going, and then uh, kind of check them out. So it doesn't show any listings in here. It just looks like he's an active user. Here's one, Richard Stewart, 23 listings, 17 listings. Uh, so you can kind of check it out and go through it. And let's see, there's one of nine of 14 total agents that are signed up with homes.com using that one. So that's one way, all right? And let's we'll move on to the next one. The next one is OnlineNewspapers.com. This one's pretty cool. Okay, so when you go to OnlineNewspapers.com, this is what comes up. This is really cool. This is actually a great tip to share with everybody. So I'm in North America. I'm going to click on North America. And then I'm going to find Listed by State. And I'm going to go to Michigan. And then here's a little trick for you. So any website you're typically on, if you hit Control-F, a little box pops up right here, okay? I'm going to punch in Kalamazoo because that's where I live. And you'll notice that Kalamazoo starts to get highlighted. So here's Kalamazoo Country, Kalamazoo Gazette. So this is my newspaper. So here's a great way to find out what's going on in your neighborhood. Of course, you'd want to find the real estate section right here. Click on real estate, and this is going to be different for every paper. So it might take you a little bit, but once you get to know where it's at, it's pretty darn easy. So you can click on this little drop down box. Now it's gonna be, again, it's gonna be different for every single paper. Of course, Kalamazoo Gazette is tied to MLive.com. That's why you're seeing this. But if I click on more, this is what I like to do. And there's probably a million different ways to do this, but click on search by zip code, click on find a home. And then what it's gonna do is gonna pop up a bunch of homes that are for sale inside the Kalamazoo Gazette. So I find out who's using it. So it con contact the broker. And then here's all the different stuff here of, of, of the different homes. Now, you, what you might have to do is go look and see which home inside your MLS this home is listed with. But at least you can get an idea of who's getting it, who's using technology, who's using the, you know, the local paper but online type version. Okay, So that's a great place to go. Next one I want to share with you guys is Craigslist. This is probably one of my favorites, especially with a single property website being so easy to look for. Uh, agents in there so let's go to Craigslist and check it out okay so once you're in Craigslist you want to make sure you're in the right city right so we're in Grand Rapids I'm gonna click on Kalamazoo and make sure I'm there and then there's a real estate section right here so click on real estate inside the real estate section you're gonna notice owner that means for sale by owner broker means by broker okay so you just I mean these are great candidates to call up and help them with selling their home with the single property website system because you can build a relationship and obviously if they sell they're probably going to buy a new home but 99 percent of the time if they don't sell they're going to go looking for an agent and you can be the first one in line to refer an agent to them because they're already using the system so what kind of how i say it is hey i have a system in place that'll help you advertise let the world know your home is for sale but if it doesn't work somewhere down the road i've you know i've positioned myself i've built a great team of top producing agents 
that can help you sell your home in today's market, okay? And then so I give them the system for free. It's a great FISBO campaign. It's also a great one to teach your real estate agents how to use approach FISBOs. So that's all you do. You go to the owner section and you, for FISBO's broker to find out what the brokers are doing. Let's just see. And Shelly, which is one of my agents, this is pretty cool. We're sitting here on a Sunday and she's posting her properties to Craigslist. So that's an actual Craigslist posting that comes up on Craigslist that people can see. All right, very cool stuff. So here's the next one, owner, 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 owner. A lot of for sale by owners here. So let's just click on one other broker. Here's another one. So here's one, here, this would be a great one. 200,000, four bedroom open house, adult foster care home. This agent is has it listed and here is the call, call Karen Dermati, five star real estate group, Grand Bell, Michigan. And here's the number. I mean, how cool is that? She's got a couple pictures. The single property website would drastically increase her exposure. Not only that, she, it would help her in other things, get more listings, attract more buyers, keep the listings she currently have. You'd be, you'd be amazed just, just by helping agents show their sellers the new systems they have in place to, to let the world know their home is for sale. So that's the next place. All right, the next one is Backpage.com. You probably haven't even heard about it before, but it's tied into single property websites. We showed you how to set it up in the training, so you've obviously heard about it now. Okay, here I am at Backpage. I'm gonna look for Michigan, because I'm in Michigan, of course. And I'm gonna click on Kalamazoo. And then in Kalamazoo, I'm gonna look for the real estate section. Home, houses, condos. That's the, probably the one I want. So I'm gonna click on housing condos, and I'm gonna see who's using it. And then here it is, effective real estate listing presentation. Here's 150, check this out. So click on this one. Here's a bunch of pictures, right? Here's a bunch of different links of something's going on here. So I could definitely call Sandy or Sandra and show her the single property website system to drastically increase her exposure. Just have a much professional, much more professional looking back page post, okay? So just wanted to share that with you. And here's some other ones she's listing. So hopefully she's using and she should be using the single property website for all of them. So here's some other ideas that you can advertise other other listings inside one listings. Now the cool part about Backpage is it's free. There's no cost to doing it. It's two clicks just like Craigslist. You just gotta set it up and that's part of the training that we covered. But this is Backpage.com, really powerful. Ads are really, really, really cheap to put here. So just check it out. Set it up for your agent, show them one more place, more exposure. You know what that means, more buyers, more listings, all that stuff, so keep that going. The last one I wanna show you is Facebook. How to find real estate agents on Facebook. This is the really cool part. Lots of them, you can have them become friends and then fans of your fan page, and that's gonna be part of the training, okay? Facebook, let's go to facebook.com, and here's the little trick. So I'm gonna go, let's go with Remax of Kalamazoo, all right? All right, so Remax of Kalamazoo, here's the little trick. There's 61 people that like this, and that's about, that's probably a little high for how many agents there is there. So I'm gonna click, I'm not gonna click on this, because that takes me to the fan page, okay? Here's the secret. Click on See More Results, and then I wanna click on the actual number of people. This is the ninja little trick here. Click on the 61 people that like this. Now, what this is gonna tell me is who is a fan of Remax that I can become friends with. And 99% of the time, it's either their clients or realtors that are a fan of the page. Here's a couple title company people that I rec uh, that I recognize, a couple bankers. But here's Rick Hoffman, the owner of it. And I mean, you can just go ahead and friend these people if they're not friends of yours. Half of them will accept your friendship, and then half of them will be your fan of your page. So now you're staying in front of hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of people. But that's how you find agents. Now, if you, wanna f if you have a specific name you wanna search, like, let's just Shelly Patterson which I know she's an agent, and I wanna become her friend, so like we're friends and everything I post she sees and everything she posts I see and we kinda of connect that way, then that would be a great way to do it. You can search individual agents and then the agents that are on Facebook actually understand the power of Facebook, depending on how many friends they have. Does that make sense? Okay, so that is it for finding new referral partners. Now I did a PowerPoint for you guys here that you guys are gonna be able to have to kinda of go over this. So realtor.com, I'll just do a little refresher here. I did homes.com, little bottom right, remember that. And then online newspaper.com, click on North America, click on the listed by state, and then pick your state. And then you go to Kalamazoo. Remember to hit the control F key, so there's a little refresher there. And then local newspapers, you can be, actually you can punch in realtors up here too, so put realtors in the search bar of your local newspaper and find them that way too. 
or just click on real estate and then and then of course little drop down box again it's going to be different depending on what part of the world you're in it's going to be totally different but i just wanted to share that with you and then craigslist broker remember hit on the broker and of course the, the owner is the fisbo great fisbo strategy and then backpage.com click on your state find out where that's at and then click on real estate house condo and then here's these ads i didn't talk much i said i mentioned them briefly but these ads on the right hand side are really powerful and they're really 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 cheap and believe it or not they do get some exposure so that's another place to show your agents or yourself put ads if you want to and then the next one is facebook click remember don't click on the actual name click on the see more and then click on the numbers like for example this one has 17,000 people that are fans of that place so Really powerful stuff here, guys. Go ahead and check it out. Take advantage of it. So many different places where agents are marketing, just not using all the tools, all the bells and whistles that they should be with the single property website so you can be their savior. You can help them grow their business, change their world. Change. You have the power to change communities, okay? Take advantage of it, implement it, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.